Hello everyone and welcome back to Microsoft Dynamics 365 Business Central introductory course. This is lecture 1 of module 5 where we will see how you can search and select information in Microsoft Dynamics 365 Business Central. Since there is huge amount of data present in your Dynamics 365 Business Central, it is very important to be able to search through that data. And you can search primarily the data that you want in the list by using the out of the box search function in the list page or you can also utilize find on page option of your browser. Let me now show you in our trial instance how you can search and select information in Dynamics 365 Business Central. So you can search your information or the data primarily in the list. So I have opened a customers list. So let me now search here find so now you can see that Dynamics 365 Business Central has find a customer which contains this in the name field. Let me now do another search. So this time I am typing East. This time Business Central has found a record text matched in the location code column. So if I do the same search, suppose I'm typing Ray. So now it is given me the information where this keyword, this string is found in the contact. So with this Dynamics 365 Business Central, we'll be able to search through multiple columns in the list that you are searching. Not only this, you can also do a partial search. Let me now show you how you can find all the customers starting with a so if you type a and press asterisk or star now you can see the dynamics 365 business central has given all the customers starting with a so this is how you can search information in your list you can also utilize the browser find on page functionality how you can activate that functionality if you type control f then you can see this text box appears and if you type Ray here it will select all the text displaying with this name you can navigate with this help of up and down let me now change this if you type main here so now you can see all the places where you can find this keyword in your list so you can navigate with the help of next and previous button so this is how you can search any information in the list page of your Dynamics 365 Business Central. So let me now show you how you can select multiple records in Dynamics 365 Business Central. I am navigating to posted sales invoices. So here you can see it has opened the list of posted sales invoices and first select any one record and click on this ellipsis three dots and the moment you click on select more button a series of checkbox appears in the front of each row and you can now select multiple records so I have selected three records why you would like to select multiple records so if you want to take a specific action on the selected records then you need to have an option to multi select them so after selecting these records let us now see if I want to print these posted cell invoices so the, if you click on print and here you can see the preview so now you can see that it has opened three reports that I have selected in my print preview mode now you can see the different invoices this is why you need to have an option to select multiple records and let us suppose if you want to select all of them then you can do it by clicking the top checkbox button and this will select all the records in your list page and you can also use a shortcut key to select all records after selecting one of the record in your list page if you press ctrl a then also it will select all the records in the page this is how you can search and select the information in any list page so on this note i will wind up this lecture in next lecture, we will see how you can sort and filter information in Dynamics 365 Business Central.
so i hope to see you all in the next lecture till then bye and take care